Hi, I'm Dave Bronsma, a SourceForge engineer. Today I'm going to show you how to host your GitHub releases on SourceForge also. This could be useful if you'd like to promote your project in more places and help more users find your software. To start, just go to the SourceForge homepage and log in, create an account if you need to, then click on the publish link. Here it describes what is available and click on publish your existing project. Here you can enter a project name, or if you have everything on GitHub already ready to import, you can click on this link to import from GitHub. As you can see, Google Code and Track importers are available as well. On this form, all you need to do is enter your GitHub username and repository name and pick a name for the SourceForge project. I have a demo repository that I'll be using. And for this walkthrough, I am only going to import the downloads. This project doesn't have any issues, source code, or wiki setup, so there's no point in importing those. But those work as well, so feel free to import those if you'd like to copy those over to SourceForge. Then you click on Import. This will prompt you for GitHub authentication if you haven't done so before. And then it will come through and import your releases from GitHub into a SourceForge project. There we go. Now this has been imported into SourceForge. It's created a new project for us. If I click on the Files tab here, It'll take a minute or two to import all your files. In the meantime, you can set up your project information, fill out a longer name, enter a, a video link if you have one, some short descriptions, There's also screenshots and categorizations that would be useful to add. Let's check on the files and see if they're set up yet. Here you can see all the files that have been imported automatically for us. These correspond to all the releases on the GitHub project that I have. If I click through to any of these directories, I can see that the release files have been imported and the release notes have been created as a readme file and displayed automatically. This first import has imported all of our existing files, our releases from GitHub. You can also set up the SourceForge project to automatically import any new releases you make on GitHub. This welcome message has a convenient link to set that up. To configure this, Again, all you need to do is enter your repository information. So I'll enter mine there. And then there's a checkbox if you want to add a SourceForge download button into the GitHub release notes when the release happens. This could be useful if you want to drive some traffic from the GitHub releases page over to SourceForge. That could be useful if you'd like to see some download statistics within the SourceForge system to get a better idea of who's downloading your software. Here I have to approve this webhook that gets configured and it's set up. So now any new releases I make on GitHub will automatically be added to this project. Now if I go to my GitHub project and make a new release I can add a binary file if I'd like to, of course. When I publish this, it will automatically be imported into the SourceForge project with no extra work.
and there it is. We'd love to hear from you and see how we can help you in your project. Contact us at sourceforge.net support.